is this contraption? Well, <laughs> we're in the middle of construction of the eBay for the experimental gliding parachute system. And normally I would just do this over the edge of a desk. But if I did that, you wouldn't be able to see this. So I had to build this little contraption here to uh, raise it up so that I can hang the strings down vertically from the eBay. So basically what I have here is a dowel that just hangs out um, so that I can just um, put it through the hole in the eBay sled and then hang the strings straight down. Because what we need to do in this step is to adjust these uh, locations of these swivels so that everything is perfectly even. So I'm going to start with the support lines, the ones that are fixed directly to the board and not the ones that with the controllers on the servo controller. So I'm just going to wind these up so that they just kind of stay out of the way. All right, so first um, I'm going to start with one line right here. And the length of this is not too important. Um, anywhere between 10 and 12 inches of hang is sufficient. Um, and in the last step, what we did was just did a simple overhand knot. And I'm going to um, just kind of loosen it up a little bit so I can slide it a little bit further down the string right here. So this one is going to be my control line. You know, so every... <laughs> Um, fixed control line. So this everything's going to be measured onto this one line. And I'm actually going to put a double knot in this line right here. And hopefully I don't have to undo this one. <laughs> okay, so this has a double knot in it. And again, um, like we did at the top, pull on it tight because we don't want that string to be moving around. Okay, so now I need to adjust the position of this one so that it is exactly the same length as measured at the bottom of the, um, the snap swivel. So again, I'm going to loosen that knot just a little bit so that I can slide it down the string. Hopefully I have enough length and I don't think I'm going to. Uh, my, my problem is, remember when I put the super glue on there, I made that so stiff um, that that's as long as I can get it. And I'm a little bit short, which means this is now the control. <laughs> Everything will be uh, aligned to this length. So again, put a double knot in that, pull on it tight, and now this one I have to undo. Uh, you know that's going to happen, right? When I say, I hope I don't, don't have to undo it. So I should probably start with the shortest line, right? Okay, so this one here is the control, and I got a shorten this one up a little bit. Okay, they're pretty close. Yeah, I just made it longer. It's gonna come down just a little. Okay. 
when you get it in place, then carefully put a double knot on it. Uh, when you do the second one, you don't want to shorten that up at all. So again, verify that they're the same length. All right, so those are the same length. Now, these are the um, control arms, and you can see that these are a lot longer. So I don't have any problem with these. Now these, when we compare it to the length of the fixed lines, we want them to be one quarter of an inch longer. These are actually the back of the, the glider. Um, so the front is towards, the, the nose of the parachute is going to be towards these fixed lines and it's steered from the back end. Okay, so this line is kind of in the way if you can't see it. So this, I'm too long here, so I need to shorten this up. So that one looks really good. Again, double check. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, so now I'll do my final line right here. Now it's too short. Oops, I felt it move really long there. But you get the idea. We want these the exact same length. Now this excess line here, I don't want to. I don't want to trim it too short, um, just in case that I have to come back and readjust. Okay, so now I want to take some masking tape and tape these up. Um, so that these um, lines, you know, we don't 
catch them. Again, anything that sticks out is possible thing that could tangle. So I've kind of um, wrapped tape around that line there like that. And I'll do that with all the other three um, and then we'll go ahead and start attaching the parachute. So that's what we'll do in the next video.